What's up boys, Day782 here with episode 27 of Fixing the Franchise here with the Montreal Canadiens in the year number 8 playoffs in the conference finals here against the New Jersey Devils here in May of 2026. In the last episode we beat the New Jersey, uh, uh, the Tampa Bay Lightning in 6 games, pretty tight series, we won every game I believe by 1 goal, am I correct? Uh, yeah, every game was decided by 1 goal, is that it? Yes, 2-1 win, 3-2 win, 2-1 win. 3-2 loss, 4-3 loss, and 4-3 win. So very, very tight series against a very good Tampa Bay Lightning team. But we survived, and now we're moving on to play against the New Jersey Devils. We're both 8-5, and five, us and the Devils. And the last episode, we looked at their lineups. Shane Nesbitt, I'll quickly refresh their lineups. We also looked at our lineup, talking about what are we going to do. I don't think I'm going to touch any of the special teams just yet. But what uh, a good point made by uh, my buddy Chris Chong is that he said, McDonald's brought us this far. We can't, you know, turn our back on him now. He's, we got to keep riding him at least until Osgood is fully uh, fully healed, fully healthy. That's what also Mikey and Chris and Yells were telling me. So we're going to keep it like that for now. They have a very good offense with Nesbitt, Hishie, Hall, Kupari on the third line. Two goal, ten points for him. Very good team. Defensively, not as strong. Uh, a pretty decent rounded core, just no one really huge or flashy. And then goaltender-wise, you got Jarmelson, who doesn't look that good, but is actually putting up fantastic numbers in the season and playoffs. So it's going to be a tough series. I'm really excited to jump into it. been a couple of days since I've done any recording, so I'm really excited to get started. So, yeah, without further ado, we're going to hop into game number one. Uh, Laval is currently in a series with uh, the Phantoms. They're up 1-0 in that series, yep. And, uh, so yeah, game number one here in Montreal of the Conference Finals against the New Jersey Devils. Here we go. First time in six years, I believe, we made it to this point. Early power play for the Devils. And <laughs> Brady Kachuk gets a shorthanded goal. Okay, and then Shifley gets... Oh, whoa, 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 what just happened? What just happened? Okay, hold on. So Spencer Connor, 30 seconds in, gets a double minor for high sticking. So that's going to go until 15.30. Wow, so we literally scored... A shorthanded goal, and then a goal one second after the power play ended. So it's like we scored two shorthanded goals and a double minor. What a way to start this game. 2 nothing. Oh, and then right as I press it, Andrews scores. Cristiano Andrews. So a 2-1 game. Wow. Halfway through this first period. My goodness. What a crazy start to this conference finals. Brady Kachuk and Mark Shifley. Shifley hasn't been scoring much. In this playoff, so happy to see him putting in one nice and early. Brady Kachuk gets another one, the team leader in points and goals. I and a hat trick for Brady Kachuk. 50, no, 25 minutes into this game, Brady Kachuk has a hat trick, and it's a 4 1 lead here for Montreal. We are leading this game 4 1 on the back of the first line, especially Brady Kachuk. Guy Papineau adds another one to make it 5 1. Guy Papineau, à way mon petit, faire une autre but pour moi ce soir. Shane Nesbitt, of course, yeah, he got one on McDonald. Got to expect a few from him. 5-2 game. Then Claude Giroux makes it 6-2. Oh, man, we're pulling away in this one, that's for sure. Power play for us. Shifley gets a power play goal. It's still power play continues. So two for Shifley, three for Kachuk. Papineau and Giroux get a few of themselves, well, one each themselves. Huge game one statement to say that we are not here to play around. We had 37 shots in this one. Three stars, Kachuk, three goals and an assist. Shifley, two goals, two assists. Spencer Connor, three assists. Huge game for us. That's it, boys. Plus four, plus four, plus four. Clef bomb, two assists. Papino and Smirnov, negative one. But they got points themselves. Ribeiro, negative one. Great game, boys. 7-2 win to take a one nothing series lead in the Eastern Conference Finals. That's it, boys. That is it. Canucks are leading their series 1-0 against the Blues. Don't tell me it's going to be a Stanley Cup Finals rematch six years later. That would be crazy. Game 2. Oh, I should check the... Oh, I just forgot to check if the goalies got rotated. Ay, ay, ay. Hold on. Ay, ay, ay. Please, please, please. Tell me. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's Osgood. Oh, Osgood, please. There's a 5 on 3 power play. Welcome back to the Nets. Chris o Gavin Osgood. What am I saying, Chris Osgood? Gavin Osgood is in Nets. Nesbitt. Yeah. Gavin Osgood, he's not ready for this. Ay, yeah, yeah. Should be McDonald. EA Cheese, bro. EA Cheese getting me. Where's all the power plays? 
Who's taking all these penalties? Pfft, look at all these penalties. Big risk, Connor, Connor, Clefbaum, Kervinen. Just for the first period. All right, second period. Being outshot 20 to 5. Kupari, 2 nothing. What a disgusting showing from us. Come on, boys. They have 30 shots. Okay, Larkin on the 8th shot of the game makes it 2-1. to one. Hiche, 3-1. Osgood. Playing, I guess, well enough. 33 shots against already. We're getting destroyed. We've taken so many penalties. Jasper Bratt. We have taken so many penalties. Kervin and Kachuk, Shifley. What? 4-1. Uh, let's go to goals. Being uh, more than double outshot. He sh let's just, I'm just going to sim it. I'm just going to... Uh. Okay, Brady Kachuk makes a 5-2. I'll, I'll watch it through. Oh, another one? What? <laughs> Larkin hooking minor. 5-2. Okay, just end it. 5-2, we lose. Two goals and an assist. Three, three assists for VC. Who took all these penalties? These are all minors. Where's penalty? Penalty minutes. Six, three minors for Connor, a fighting for Shifley, two minors for Kervinen, and one, two, three, four other players with minors. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine penalties. Come on, we lose five to two. Why is Osgood in nets? Why is my coach rotating goalies? Ah, oh, I gotta go fix that. Ay, yeah, ay, yeah, ay, I should have checked. I should have checked. Get out of there, Osgood. Come on. McDonald, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I hope you're not feeling disrespected at all. Game three in New Jersey. 1-1 one, one series. Let's get back in this, boys. Huge game one. Let's see that again in game three. Game two, a little hiccup. Goaltenders were weird. The whole equilibrium was off. Ton of penalties. Let's change that. Brady Kachuk says, I will change that after taking his two minor penalties last game. One nothing for us. That is ninth of the playoffs. I'm not sure. I forgot how many points he had. Eight goals, six assists, maybe. First period comes to an end. Shots eleven to ten for us. One nothing lead. Let's keep it up, boys. Strong defensively and keep hitting them offensively as well. Good power play. For, we kill their power play and then we get one for ourselves, but nothing comes from it. Very even shots, exchanging the lead back and forth. Second period drawing to a close. And that'll be it for the second. Heading into the third, shots are 23 to 20 for New Jersey, and we lead one to nothing. Holding on to that one nothing lead. Let's get another one. Power play, yes. Mark Shifley on the power play. What a series he has been having. Mark Shifley, baby. Two nothing for us with 10 minutes left to go in this third period. Come on, boys. Power play for New Jersey. We kill it off. Five minutes left. Three minutes. Two minutes. One minute. And Larkin gets an empty net goal. And we win this 3-0. Mason McDonald, the 30-save shutout. What a monster out there. Goal and an assist for Brady Kachuk. Mason McDonald is unreal lights out in this playoffs. 16 points in 16 games for Kachuk. 2-1 series for uh, St. Louis as well against the Canucks. Mason McDonald has been unreal in these playoffs. And I'm really happy that he didn't lose it for some reason after that game where Osgood was playing. Let's check out the points here. Mark Shifley on a tear. I don't think he was in this position of second place uh, before the series begun began. I believe it was Connor. So Shifley has 14 points in 16 games now. Connor 13 and 16. Larkin 10. I'm surprised. He's doing well in the third line center role. Giroux hasn't done much since he had like two goals and eight assists or five assists in the first round. Two goals, five assists. No, is that what he had? And he only got one assist in last series. No, that can't be true. He didn't have much in, in Tampa series. And it's one goal in three games in this series. Ralph Marsh, okay. Eight points in 16 games with a plus seven. Very nice. Uh, where's Donnie Dex? Four points in nine games. Still a negative two, though. I don't like those defensive categories, but he's getting it done. Smirnov, I mean, Clefbaum is surprised. Only three points in 16 games, but hey, plus five. Can't complain too much there. Uh, Butcher, uh, Chris Agnels was telling me to push him up with the second pair, but... I forgot to do it, and now it seems that things are going well, so I won't touch it just yet. And with that being said, we will hop into game number four. Wait, I will check the goalies first. Oh, they tried to get me. They tried to get me, but don't worry. McDonald's back, baby. I'm not going to turn off auto-rotate goalies, because I'm just going to forget to turn it back on when the season starts. So that's taken care of, and game number four. We have a 2-1 series lead 
heading into game four in New Jersey, looking to take a big series lead back to Montreal. Early power play for us. Nothing. 0-0 zero, zero game, five minutes in. Calm it down, boys. Keep it nice and... What's, what's the word I'm looking for? Nice and strong offensively. Yeah, that's the word I'm looking for. Nice and strong offensively. Good defense. Mark McLeod gets one. Is it Mark McLeod? Or, no, sorry, Michael McLeod, I believe. One nothing. Devils heading into the second period. Shots 13-12 to 12 in our favor. Devils lead by one. Spencer Connor, baby. Makes it a 1-1 game. Big goal for Connor. 14th point in 17 games throughout these playoffs. Been a huge presence. That first line just really stepping up on a new level in these playoffs, especially in the first round, I think, where they were exploding, with especially Connor. Brady Kachuk, this has been his round, man. Brady Kachuk, I believe that's five goals in four games for Kachuk. The hat trick plus one last game. No, the hat trick in game one got one in game two. I'm not sure if he got one in game three, so he either has four or five goals through four games. And that's a 2-1 lead for us heading into the third shots 25-18. to 18. Brady Kachuk with a huge go-ahead goal. Power play for New Jersey. We kill it off. Good pound and kill this uh, playoff round as well. I don't believe we left. Recording crouches for a quick second there. 444 left in the third period. Shots 36 to 26 in our favor. And a 2-1 lead for us. Can we close out this game? Ah, of course. The curse of the pause. Whenever you press pause and you press continue, I find very often the goal happens right away. Kunakl ties up the game with two minutes left in the third. And we're going to overtime. So shots 37 to 28. I blame the recording pause. Shots 37 to 28. 2-2 two -two game. Headed into overtime. Let's check it out. Overtime number one. 2-2 two -two game. Who will take it? Will it be a 2-2 two -two series headed back to Montreal? Or will we lead it 3-1 headed into home territory? Big hit from Shifley there. Shifley's never been shy about staying in the guts of the game. He's a skip. Oh, what a mean, Big hit from Connor. That That's a penalty was. coming That's up. Probably going to bring an answer. <laughs> Vatman blocked by Kachuk. Now be a penalty a for Spencer Connor. Could what's he getting? I couldn't see a signal. Boarding probably. Montreal's minor is for boarding. Yeah. Two minutes for boarding for Spencer Connor. Power play now for New Jersey. Larkin and Kachuk are out on the defense. We have a winner. That's great defense. Shot back out. All's fine. The Devils are moving the puck in the defensive zone. And glides on through center ice. Big Climber, hit. huge hit. Oh, Jody Climber. Like a young Jody Shelley out there. Pari, who's he know? Broken up. VC. Pari, stopped by McDonald. Who's he know? Pari, back to the save. point. Uh, I'm not sure that was. We got hit off by Larkin, but then it got kept in the zone. Left bomb, can't get it. Kupari, VC, and then he can't get it away from. I think that was bomb with him off the puck. Larkin tries to clear it. Wasn't quite far enough. There's a chance for Vatnin, can't get past Climber. Vatnin with it again, held along the boards. Kicks it to McLeod. McLeod to Cousino, back to McLeod. To Vatnin, scores! Sammy Vats. And just like that, we are headed to Montreal for game number five with the series tied 2-2. Two to two. Man, I really thought we had that. I shouldn't jump into these simulations, man. Ah, it's devastating. Oh, boy, what are you going to do? Ten goals, eight assists for Brady Kachuk. What a... What a playoffs, man. So, just like that, series also tied to two in the West. Come on. Am I not here? Simulate up to this day. Let me check my goalies as well once more. Nope. Back to McDonald. There you go. All right. So, game five in Montreal. Who will take the 3-2 lead? Will it be Montreal headed to New Jersey to finish it off? Or will it be New Jersey looking to finish the series at home? No, what am I saying? We're in Montreal. Yeah, okay, yeah. Early power play for us doesn't pay off. Getting outshot Jimmy VC against his old team, the Montreal Canadiens. We didn't play him very well. Oh, Jimmy. Man. 
All right, first period comes to a close. Shots 14 to 10 for New Jersey, and they lead 1 to nothing. <sighs> Nesbitt. Come on, McDonald. Come on, Mason. Power play, New Jersey. Kill it off, boys. There we go. There we go. Let's get one before the third. One before the third. Look, come on, boys. Four minutes. Ay, ay, ay. Power play, New Jersey. Pfft. I didn't hit the third period being outshot terribly. 34 to 14 currently. And then Spencer Connor. Okay, makes it 2 1 with about half the period left to go. Thought, shots are 36 to 17. Power play, New Jersey. Ah, uh, Cousino. That's, it's over. Forget it. 42 to 19 the shots. Come on, boys. That's crazy. McDonald can't do everything. Come on, boys. Don't tell me I have to go to seven. We have to go to seven games again if we want to win this series. I will not go gentle. We have to win this. We have to win this series, boys. Come on. All right, let's check out the lines before we go into this game. Okay, lines. McDonald's in. Okay. Dexter, you've done zero this series. Uh, Marsh, you're coming up. Bird, you've done zero in this series, I'm pretty sure. Where do I put you? Larkin, you're going to go here. Drew, you're going to go here with Dexter, Kervinen. Smirnov, Ribeiro, whatever. People like that. Barrett has done... I, I forgot Barrett was even on this team. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Do I move Bigris? One, five, one... Yeah, butcher. Oh, do I move Clefbaum? I'm not going to touch the defense. Yeah, I'm not going to touch it. All right, those will be the lines for game six in New Jersey. <sighs> Win and push it to seven. Here we go. This is it. This is what the years have been leading us to. Quick goal from Dylan Larkin on that second line. Very nice. This isn't quite what the years... <laughs> and A.J. Bird, okay. 2 nothing. Power play goal, A.J. Bird. And Seth Ribeiro. A quick 3 nothing lead halfway into the first. I meant to say is that we need to get to that place where it's been leading us for years to actually try and push to the Stanley Cup Finals. But this game is definitely a must-win if we want to even think about that. So heading into the second period, Bastion scores with a minute 29 left on McDonald. And it is a 3-1 game with us leading shots 12-8 to as well. Up by two with 40 minutes to play. Power play for us. Long power play for us. Come on, boys. Disappointing. But A.J. Bird finally woke up and got one earlier, which is quite a surprise. And Claude Giroux on that third line. I like switching those centers. Ended up working a little bit. Uh, switching them up and switching Giroux down has worked <laughs> both ways. I put him up in the second round and then now down in the third round. Give him a little jump. So now we lead 4-1 to one, heading into the third. Out shooting New Jersey 21-18. to 18. AJ Bird, baby, I called you. I called you out and you delivered. That's two goals for him tonight. Taylor Hall makes it 5-2. to two. This first goal of the series, I think. 5-on-3 power play for us. Nothing comes from that. Why was it 5-on-3? You got two quick ones? Yeah, within a few seconds of each other, yeah. Uh, goals. 5-2 game with six-ish minutes to go. Can we hold on? I really hope we can. Dylan Larkin seals it 6-2. to two. And the Montreal Canadiens are pushing 7, as usual. Nesbitt gets a late one. Three goals on 22 shots against McDonald, but not enough. Here we go. Two, one. Three stars in this one. Two goals, one assist for Bird. Two goals for Larkin. And a goal and an assist for Giroux. Big game. Uh, let's check stats here. Uh, let's see. Three points for Bird. Two for Biggers. Two for Giroux. Two for Larkin. One for Barrett. Climber. Dexter even threw an assist, finally. Ribeiro had that Smirnov. Who didn't score? I'm sure it's Shifley and Kachuk are the ones who didn't score. Even get a shot. Kachuk only got one shot. But regardless, we have a 6-3 win and we're headed back home for game number seven. A win and we're off to the Stanley Cup Finals. Canucks and Blues are also going to seven. Wow. If we can just... Hold on. Scout. If we can win that game, we will be off to the Stanley Cup Finals against one of those two teams for a chance at the Stanley Cup. Wow, wow, wow. Did Laval make it through? They did. They beat the Phantoms. And now they're playing against the Moose. 
for the championship in Laval. Wow, Laval really having good teams the last few years. I'm not sure what really there is to do here. Just make sure the goalies are good. I'm going to keep the lines how they are. Bird, Larkin, Marsh, Dexter, Giroux, all those guys. Won't touch them. McDonald's and Nets. Riding him, man, through 17 games. His record, 10, 5, and 2. Two shutouts, 918 save percentage, 2.48 goals against average. I'm going to trust him to only let in two or three, hopefully, and we can score more than that. Hopefully we can score more than that. Let's go, boys. Game number seven. In Montreal. Let's do it. Let's do it, boys. First period. First period. Let's draw first blood, boys. Shots are very even. I'm probably going to be quiet in this one for a bit. He should gets a quick, uh, for the first one at least, against McDonald. one nothing Devils. Oh, no. Jesper Bratt. 2 nothing Devils. <sighs> okay, Chris Bigris makes it a 2-1 game. That was huge going into the second period. We needed that. Shots 15-11 to for New Jersey, also leading 2-1. Second period. Down by one. Come on, boys. Kachuk, Shifley. Connor, Bird, Larkin, Giroux, Barrett, Clefbaum. I'm calling to you, boys. Yes, Ralph Marsh. Ralph Marsh. Ah, oh, McLeod. Ah, oh, Ralph Marsh. And Spencer Connor. Let's go, boys. Spencer Connor. 3-3 three, three game. 3-3 three, three game. Ah, oh, Hoglander. Come on, boys. Hoglander, the fourth liner. Oh, oh no. McDonald, you let in five goals. You let in five goals, McDonald. You let in five goals. No, 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 no. McDonald, you let in five goals. I said three. You let in five. Ay, ay, ay. Shots are 30 to 22. 5 3 Devils heading into the third period. <sighs> Come on, boys. Going times four sim a bit slower. Oh my 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 halfway through the third haven't done anything. Boys, 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 boys. Yes, Claude Giroux. Okay. Claude Giroux. It's a five four game for New Jersey. Seven thirty one left in the third. Do I go in? Do I go in? With seven thirty one left. Wait a bit more. Oh, yeah, quick one. 5 4, boys. 5 4. Maybe with five minutes left, I'll go in. Yes, AJ Bird. Oh, my goodness. AJ Bird. Yes. Yes, AJ. AJ! Oh, my goodness. We're down 5 to 3, and now a 5 5 game with five minutes left in the third period. Oh, I have to go in, don't I? Yeah, I, I have to go in. I'm not going to make a 20-minute period, though. <laughs> oh, my. It's a 5-5 five, five game in Game 7. Oh, my. Oh, me, oh, my. Make it 10-minute uh, periods, I guess. Go a bit quicker. Five minutes left. In Game 7, next goal could potentially send you to the Stanley Cup Finals. Ay, ay, ay. We can do it, boys. We can do it. Five it's always minutes way left. more fun when there's lots of goals Bar in the Oh, the black guy. The Tristan like Barrett's the black guy on the team. Ones trying to figure out who it was. The generated ones player. So crazy about it, but <laughs> anyway. I will tell you who hates it. It's the coaches. Dexter. They always want to uh, have some control of the game. <laughs> How? Moving it now through Please, the neutral zone. Simulation Please don't break in. my head with Very impossibilities of physics. Oh my. Class bomb, you kill me. Jean-Gabriel Pajot. He made the right decision by passing the... Skip, bro. I don't want to see this. Quickly from below the goal line. The Devils have broken the tie here in the third period. So what will be their philosophy now? 
probably see it from this opening faceoff. New Jersey's looking to head man up the wing. Looking to shine. Fifteen minutes, thirty-seven seconds. Swept on to Tokarski. He's trying to spring him ahead, and he's got him. Tokarski's move might have fooled some, but not all. Up the wing, still with possession, oh, and with oh, come on, Connor, to Chuck Shifley. Oh, save by the goalie. come on, boys, Shifley right misses it on time. Look at Chuck, Barrett, off the mark, Chuck, to the Connor, stick. looking for room, Connor. slides it to Shifley, passed across point to point, Barrett. Barrett. throws it in front, pass across at the point, Barrett, looks for Barrett. room. Shoot! Someone shoot! New Jersey's in control as they travel up the wing. Stopped him from going any further. They won that faceoff. Can they clear it? That's good. Right near the line. AJ. Can he keep it going? AJ Larkin. Oh. Oh. Grab. Um, that hit okay. somebody. Ralph Marsh. Okay, we Ralph. 50 seconds left. Ralph. Oh, look at the net. Wonderful three, chance. What an outstanding Bastion. look, but he just missed the net. Okay, he's bumped. Bro, we only have 30 seconds. You gotta skate up, bro. You gotta skate. Kerman, bro, Dexter. Dexter! Oh! Oh, what a great chance. That would have really put the pressure on him. And off he was right there. Climber. Goalie's pulled. Climber, don't waste this chance. Climber. Okay, Butcher. You wasted it. You wasted it. Why did you waste it? He's got that pet net empty. Hey, I can hit the now. That's a good solid hit. He'll feel and that one. Thought he had 10 feet of clean ice. He only had five. There's the stop zone. Yeah. Tied up, but a good reach and a good step in there for possession. Only a few seconds remaining before the celebrating can start down on the ice because they have won the third round. They were one of the He's four best teams standing, but that's not what they wanted. They wanted to be the last one. It did not happen this time. This is always kind of fun. It... So I kind of just skipped through most of the animations because I didn't know what to say. <laughs> just devastated, bro, the system. If I just watched the simulation, who knows what would have happened. But you know how it is. It's a YouTube series. want to make it entertaining. want to watch it. And because of that, I let in a garbage goal. McDonald lets in six goals. When's the last time he let in six goals, the guy? Doesn't make sense, man. My goalie, my players play so well. They let in six goals. My defense is garbage. I have Clefbaum who can't get a point even though he's amazing. It just doesn't make sense, man. That's what just kills me. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Who doesn't have to go through waivers? You guys can all go down and go play in Laval. I didn't say to exit. Laval, you guys can go on a nice championship run. There you go. Where's Old Bang? Old Bang. There you go. Murata up here. Whatever, good enough. Just put them like that. Just disappointing, man. Game seven. It's always game seven. It's always some garbage sim. It's always game seven. It's never clear. Let's see what happens in Laval. Some of you guys were even worse with better players in our lineup, right? Man. Another rough. Close to a season. <laughs> We're going to win game seven here against the Moose. 
We've lost six games all playoffs, and three of them have come in this series. Can't even score with these 80 overalls in our lineup. Solid loss in game seven. Whatever. Vancouver Canucks, Stanley Cup champions. They beat the Devils pretty quick, I think. In the time that the series went like six games, they beat the Devils. Yep, in five. <laughs> Devils are trash. Scoring for us in the end. Chuck 19 points in 20 games, Connor 17, Shifley 16, Bird 15, Dexter 6 and 13, Carl, these guys are all garbage, Butcher on my trade, you guys are all down in overall because they're sad, Clefbaum I'm probably going to trade I think, didn't like him this season, getting old, Barrett, obviously going to keep him, just disgusted with his performance, ay ay ay. Draft lottery, Toronto has a couple picks there. Chicago picks first, followed by Washington. Was it LA third? I don't know. Retired players. Did he call it? He did. Claude Giroux calls it a career. 1,179 points in 1,392 games. No goalies, right? Yeah, no goalies. All players. Evgeny Malkin retires as well. Steven Stamkos, Phil Kessel, Claude Giroux, Jonathan Taze, David Krejci, Brad Marchand. Huge names. Drew Doughty retired. Wow, good thing I, I traded him when I did. At 88 overall, he retired. That is crazy. Who else had a... Anyone else have a high overall when retiring? Sam, oh yeah, I just noticed, yeah, Stamkos. 89 overall, he retires. 691 goals. Wow. Wayne Simmons, Matt Duchesne, Jordan Eberle. Huge years for retirement. Lucic, Latang, Subban, Yossi, Green. Wow. Jake Gardner. Jake the Snake couldn't get one more cup. Yanni Gord retired? What? He's 34? What? Crazy, man. Goalies? Any big goalies? Tuka Rask, Steve Mason, Cam Talbot. Yeah, some big names there. Man, big year for retirements in uh, 2026. Trade block heading into the draft. Uh, Obey, I don't want to trade. I still like him. Murata, no. Why did I leave Obey there? I just said I don't want to trade him. How did Kachuk lose a quarter, uh, like a fifth bar of value? Clefbaum, I'm really tempted to trade. Let me know your thoughts on Clefbaum being moved. Does he only have one year left? He's, but, uh, he's an expiring deal, no? Or is it... Let me see here. Yeah, he's not going to... I can't even trade him. He's on an expiring deal. Uh, Shifley is getting old, maybe. Maybe Shifley, I don't know. Uh, who else is trade bait? Ribeiro, maybe. And then I'll put Butcher as well. I don't know if I want Ribeiro sticking around on this team. Let me check out the wants. Uh, depth for depth defense? No, I'd like uh, Doctor will probably play second line next year, so I'll, I'll keep third line. Actually, I'll change third line checking to third line scoring. Third line scoring forward, and I'll say top two and top four D. Say that forward. No defense. What was it? Top two, top two and top four. Yeah, that'll be it for that. Okay. So here at the draft, that's it for that. Let's check out uh, awards, and then we'll close this one off. Awards. Canucks won the Cup, President's Trophy, the Flyers, Campbell, Canucks, Devils, the Prince of Wales. Art Ross, Tarasenko, Hart Tarasenko, James Norris, Linden, oh, Lady Bing, Tarasenko, Calder, Valley Cat, Con Smythe, Thatcher Demko, that's his second Con Smythe, Vezina to Carter, Hart, Jennings, Vasilevsky, and Yolkunin, Bill Masterton to J uh, Johansson, Selkie to Draper, back-to-back. -back. He's probably going to be winning it for a long time. Ted Lindsay to Tarasenko. And Morris Richard to Connor McDavid. 
Let's check player stats for the entire league. Lafreniere, 23 points in 20 games. Brock Besser, 23 and 23. Jonathan Dahlin. Jake DeBrusque had 22 points in 23 games. They just... Ugh, my players love flourishing on Vancouver. Jake DeBrusque. Do I have anybody else here? I hope not. I don't think so. No, thank goodness I don't. Jonathan, how does DeBrusque get 22 points in 23 games? What did he do in the season this year? Did he do anything in the season? 46 point season, 20 goals? Ay, ay, ay. Whatever, man. So I guess that's it for this one. We had a good run in the playoffs, but it just wasn't quite enough. Let's gear up, let's retool, and we'll get on another run next year. So let me know your thoughts, who we should trade for, what we should do, who should be moved for what, what do we need, and uh, also just quickly check the draft class here. There's no huge names, it doesn't seem like. No franchise players, no. No franchise players. But there will be some good people in the draft later on. I got some people tagged, whatever, 6th round, 3rd slash 4th exact elite, 4th slash 5th top 5. But it's going to be an okay draft. So let me know your thoughts. I'm sorry that we couldn't go further, but I uh, always appreciate you guys tuning in. So thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.